Hey there and welcome back to Footy Today. We got four bite-sized stories to cover including a shocking possible transfer for Jadon Sancho to move to Chelsea, Ikai Gundogan going back to Manchester City having just spent one season at Barcelona, Real Sociedad demanding 5 million extra from Arsenal and the possibility of Everton being taken over will be known by the end of the week. Let's begin. According to Fraser Gillen of TeamTalk.com, Chelsea are reportedly considering a late move for Manchester United winger Jadon Sancho with potential departures like Noni Madweke opening the door for his arrival. While discussions with Sancho's camp have been light, a deal may depend on outgoings and Manchester United's willingness to accept a £35 million offer. Chelsea are also actively pursuing Victor Oshiman, though his high asking price remains a challenge. Manchester City have agreed to re-sign Ikai Gundogan from Barcelona at no cost, with the German midfielder set to return just after one season in Spain. Gundogan has agreed to personal terms and will sign a one-year deal with an option for another season. Meanwhile, City are exploring a move for Celtic's Kyogo Furuhashi as a potential replacement for Julian Alvarez, with the striker keen to join and willing to accept a squad role. Kyogo has impressed at Celtic, scoring 54 goals in 83 matches. Arsenal are close to finalising the signing of Mikko Marino from Real Sociedad, despite reports that Sociedad have raised their asking price from 35 million euros to over 40 million euros. Marino's agent remains confident that the deal will go through. Fabrizio Romano also agrees with this and says that both clubs are continuing negotiations. Meanwhile, Arsenal are also working on offloading Aaron Ramsdale, with Wolves being his likely destination. Once Ramsdale is sold, Arsenal will then look to secure a new goalkeeper. John Texter is in Liverpool to finalise talks with Everton owner Farhad Moshiri over a potential takeover, with a deal expected by the end of the week. Texter's Eagle Football Group is aiming to purchase a majority stake in Everton, after previously being overlooked in favour for the Friedkin Group, who withdrew due to concerns over loans. Texter may need to sell his 45% stake in Crystal Palace to comply with Premier League rules, with multiple parties expressing interest in buying his shares. Sources believe the Everton takeover could be delayed until January due to stadium financing arrangements. So there you have it, what are your thoughts on these stories? Is it a smart idea for Sancho to move to Chelsea? Would he even get into the starting 11 and would he even make it into the 25-man squad as they currently have over 40 senior players? Gundogan returning back to City, this has to be a no-brainer. Would Marino be a success at Arsenal? And will Everton finally be sold? Drop your comments below. Before you go, if you could do us a favour and hit the like and subscribe buttons, not only does it help push this video out to others, but it really does help our channel out a great deal. Also, smash the bell notification icon so that you never miss an upload and stay up to date with all the latest trending news. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again.